Hello, my name is Waldo and welcome back to Sunless Sea. It's season two of uh, my series on Sunless Sea because we are, well, we have died quite miserably the last time we played. <laughs> uh, I, I selected a legacy for my next captain. I was going to be a pupil uh, of myself. And then I loaded up Sunless Sea today and I pressed new game and it said, are you sure you want to start a new game? Because it said continue as well. But I said, no, I want to start a new game because I want to start with a new captain. And then I realized that I'm not inheriting my own legacy if I start a new game. But the harm was done. So instead of about, what, 4,000 echoes, 3,000 echoes, we start with 70 once again. And as I recall correctly, the stuff that used to make me money early game, like ferrying tomb colonists, has been nerfed since then. So this is going to be quite interesting to see how the hell we are going to make some money. <laughs> anyway, it is time for us to um, sail out. We have just selected our past. We are a poet once again. We were a poet before. It's my favorite background, really. It's my favorite background. Because Poetry is, is something that's very dear to my heart. I'm a bit of a, a writer. I studied literature myself, so it's quite endearing to me to be, to be a poet in this game. Right. Fulfillment, uh, gather a hundred tales, and write a masterpiece. I think I got that one before. Your Father's Bones is a questline I'd really like to explore someday when it, get re when it gets released. I hear we're quite close to the release of... Uh, the Father's Bones legacy or, or um, ambition, but it's not there yet, so we can't pick it. The uttermost east, find what lies beyond the map's edge, that would be cool too. Private Kingdom would be cool too, because private kingdoms are really awesome, because you can make your own laws, do whatever you want, but for now we'll go with fulfillment once again. And they will address me as. Uh, well, even though I technically don't have the, my dad's legacy, or my, my master's legacy, because I should have been my own pupil, but then I fucked up, because I'm an idiot. S but still, I'm, I'm gonna pretend that I'm already well accomplished, and I'm gonna have them call me my lord. A pleasure to welcome you on board, my lord. Alright, cool. And for our portrait... Who do I want to be? Oh, yeah. there's an extra one over my name. That's not me. Looks like some kind of anime character. I'm not anime. That's a female pirate. That's a Medusa. That's a guy with a bit of a whip nose. Whippy nose. And a hat. May I want to be whip nose? Alright. My name shall be Guy... Oh, hello? Guy... Yes, it, it writes, but I have to guess what it says. Guy... What knows? There we go. And we're in Fallen London. Excellent. All voyages start here. And this is where successful voyages end. Um, before we set off, let's, let's collect some stuff. Let's go to the Admiralty Survey Office and ask for some information that they need. Uh, Gator's Morn. Alright. We need to go to Gator's Morn. We need to. Uh, hire on more crew? Nah, we don't have the money to get more crew on at the moment. Because we you never know, times might get tough. There may be an economic crisis at hand. Just around the corner that we don't know. Right. An emigrant will pay to be taken north to Vanderbite. Instead of three tomb colonists, we now get one. So that's the nerf. And I'm not sure whether um, you can still do it infinitely. I'm, I'm pretty sure they nerfed that as well. That you can, um, you know, only do it so often before you get uh, wrecked by the tomb colonists. That's a... Uh, I don't know. I don't know why tomb colonists would be bothered with by you ferrying them again uh, for payment. I know the tomb colonists. I mean, they're pretty much dead. So 
logic goes out the window with the very nature of the tomb colonists. News from home. The Echo Bazaar, that enigmatic mar marketplace, has increased its tax on love stories. All right, yeah. Because the traitor empress has forbidden singing in the street outside her palace because it's too happy. So we've got some news as well, and everything else is locked. So I think that's good. Let's check our supplies. We may want to buy a bit of food before we set off. Fuel, nah, fuel's fine. Nine fuel, perfect. I am, go however, gonna buy a couple of supplierinos, supplieronies. Yeah, that'll be fine. I think. Yeah. Cool. All right, here we go. Launch. Turn off our lights. All right. It's <laughs> seems to be a tiny bit. Choppy. Once again, not the waves, but the frame rates. Uh, turn ship. Turn for the love of God. What the hell is going on with my ship? Is it because we started a new game that the world needs to load? Look at the map. We know nothing! Alright. I'm gonna go through the back here. That's what she said. Actually, what he said. And this is Hunter's Keep, where we can meet the sisters. But we're not going to do that just yet. Because we're not really in need of uh, lunch. We've, we've barely departed. Dear Christ. Have some, have some balls, men. Please. We don't need to have lunch immediately after departure. Right, okay, we should be clear of the ship that is roaming around here, the pirate ship. This is a light ship, so we're fine. Oh, whoa, 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 bat swarm, bat swarm. Get, get out of here, bat swarm. Ooh, two bat swarms, shit. We're being ambushed by bats. It's a bad ambush. Ugh, Batman, save me. All right, let's, let's fire on these motherfuckers. Select, select these guys. No, I want to... Hello? Select select this bat swarm? Yes, thank you. Oh, let's fire on the bat swarm. Almost, almost. Come on, man. Yeah. Damn it, man. How difficult can it be to fire at a set of bats in a swarm? See, there you go. Oh, dear. Man, we've made them angry. Um, oh, dear. Rotate. Turn about! Alright, there go the bat swarms. Bat swarms? There go the bats. I can see why we died quite miserably last time. If that is the set or the extent of our firing skills, we can't even kill a few bats, for flip's sake. Alright. Shall we gather up the corpses, or dispose of them? Do we need to reduce terror? No, 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 moment. Into the pot! And we've gained one supplies. Cool. I'm gonna slow down a bit to make our turn. All clear. We press E, so that our... Uh, oh dear. Not all clear! Full speed ahead, men! Get the flip away from that ship. That's probably an enemy. I hope that it still clearly indicates which ships are enemies and which ones aren't. I still hope that the neutral ships have uh, blue markings around them. Oh dear, we're gonna hit the coast. Uh, turn around! Turn around! Carissa! Um, let's get some, uh, get some map vision here. Let's have a look at the Mayan temple to our right, to the east. Tanachuk, with magic golden crab hanging out near it. Slow down a bit so we can turn into the port of whatchamacallit's Come on. Come on. Uh, 
Uh. Oh shit, another bat swarm. Don't get mad, bat swarm. Oh, what the balls is this? What is that? Is that a neutral ship that just teleported right out? Yeah, apparently. It's oh, there we go. <laughs> I th yeah, the 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 ships, the neutral st ships still seem to need a bit of work. <laughs> right. The trouble with tomb colonists. You've brought this decaying emigrant north. Now what? The new tall tomb colonist surveys Vendabite, shaking her head. It won't do, she says. It won't do at all. Hi. I just ferried you all the way here with a slightly choppy frame rate, avoiding stupid pirate ships and doing battle with Z bats. And you're not even happy with us being here? Come on. Come on. I had no idea the place would be quite so unprepossessing. Perhaps we can live liven it up a little yet. You're almost dead. If only I knew a helpful Z captain. Bring ten units of mushroom wine to Vendabite and perhaps they'll have something for you. Huh. So can we not ferry more tomb colonists until we bring mushroom wine to Vendabite? Then. I don't know. But I've lost the tomb colonists, so I can't even... I can't even sell it. Ah, uh, I can't sell my tomb colonists. What the... God damn it, tomb colonists. You had one job. Giving me money. Ugh. Stupid tomb colonists. Alright, fine. Fine. We will help you. Fine. First, we will... Explore Vendabite a bit. With an interlude. You pause for refreshment at a Hungarian cafe. The coffee is dusty and the pastries are a little stale, but the gaggle of decaying violin players are skilled and surprisingly sprightly. They play Eat Our Hearts, My Darling. The king is tall, tall, and Pop Coes the Weasel with brio and conviction, or brio and conviction even. Then they start on the old dark ocean under the world. <laughs> you realize the time. Your ship awaits you. Uh, it was all fun and games at the bar until they started playing all by myself, when I suddenly had to leave. Uh, it, it was so cold outside that my eyes started to tear up. It was completely not because of feelings. Anyway, let's get out of Vendabites. Um, I'll gather some gossip first. Now we have a port report that we can deliver. Fine, fair enough. Let's get out of here. <laughs> 